Oke, okay, bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. So, today we are going to talk about the skills uh, six of adverb clause connector. So, before that, we already learned about coordinate connectors. So, today we are going to talk about adverb clause connectors. So, uh, yeah, adverb clause uh, connector, it's supposed to be this one. Okay, so you have to pay attention about this one. And uh, Okay, so you just, you just omit this one because it is incorrect. Okay, so uh, this is kinds of connectors. Okay, you know, about time, after, as, before, since, until, while, and cause as well, because and since, uh, condition, and also contrast. Okay, so let me give you uh, the example of this one. Now, because Matt passed, he felt good. He felt good because Matt felt good because he passed. Okay. Okay. So take a look at for the example number one. Blah blah blah. Arrived at the library. He started to work immediately. So, uh, it could be the students because we know that this is a verb and supposed to be followed with uh, the subject. But the problem is, so is there there is a something that connect one sentence with another one such as for instance if you choose the students the student arrived at the library he started to work immediately it is not a good a sentence as a whole sentence because there is no adverb close connectors so but what if we use uh adverb close connector so what about this one so we have this yeah after the student arrived at the library he started to work immediately does it make sense yes of course it is makes sense because we know that this is very very uh, good in a sentence okay so what about if you use this when arrived at the library he started to work immediately yeah it is good but it is not refers to the subject who's the subject there's no subject here okay and he started what about he he started the library he started work immediately yeah it is good but it is not uh followed with the skill six adverb clause connectors okay next uh i would like to give you one of the example for exercise six in exercise six so there is a for number four okay study for number four so the number four is the waves are amazingly high high when the storm uh, hit the coastal town so uh, for number four do you think that it is kinds of a good sentence that show you adverb close connector the wave were amazingly high when the storm hit the coastal town yes it is correct because this is uh, the sentence is makes sense. Okay, so what about number? F uh, but the question: Where is uh, adverbial close? This one when. Okay, and then for number uh, five, we need to get a new car whether it's is on sale or not. Okay, so what about number five? So number five. Is there something uh, unclear enough here? We need to get a new car, whether, so it is adverbial close, but there is no subject here. There is no subject here, so subject must be followed with this one. So, it is incorrect, because what? Because there is no subject here. So, the correct one is, we need to get a new car, whether it is on sale or not. Number six. Just the bread came out of the oven, while the wonderful aroma filled the kitchen. Number six. It is correct or incorrect? What is it? Just as, just as, blah, 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 blah. Well, arrow, 
wonderful aroma fill the kitchen okay it is incorrect i guess because why it is incorrect because there is a double adverb uh, connector so what is it just as and the second one is while so what you're going to do try to omit try to delay this connector it will be good uh, sentence if there is like this just as the bread came out of the oven wonderful aroma filled the kitchen okay next for number seven for number seven everyone has spent the time on packing boxes since the family moved into the new house so did you find out that where is the adverbial clause connector this one since semenjak or because it could be and the question is is it correct yes it is correct because the sentence makes sense okay number eight for number eight itself, although the area is a desert, many plants bloom there, there in springtime. So, we find out something wrong here. Although the area is a desert, there is a desert. That it should be comma. There is no comma. So the point is no comma. Comma nya harus ada di sini. Okay, for number nine, for number nine itself, the drivers on the freeway drove slowly and carefully while the rain was falling heavily because they did not want to have an accident. Wow, so this is the adverb uh, connector. So, because, okay, so the question is, is it correct or incorrect? Correct, the sentence is correct. So what about number 10? For number 10 itself, if you plan carefully, if you plan if you plan carefully before you take a trip, we'll have a much better time because the small detail will not cause a problem. So something wrong here? Yes, because what there is no there is no subject yeah good there is no subject missing subject here so it would be better if there is subject here if you plan carefully before you take a trip you will have nah, this you need you okay that is for uh, exercise six for skill six so i would like you to uh, find out or try to figure out about the the answer of a Number one, number two, number three, until number nine for skills five and nine. Okay, that's all for today. Thank you for your attention and Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.